Hello. Today we will learn about DeepFit, a deep learning-based fitness center equipment use prediction. This paper is published in Mobiquitous 2019. Given the importance of physical activity and exercise in the long sedentary working hours of modern life, fitness centers play a crucial role in promoting good health and wellness. Having access to fitness center equipment that works with an individual's schedule is essential for the person to engage in physical activity and maintain a healthy lifestyle. We tackle the fitness center equipment usage prediction problem, where the objective is to accurately predict future equipment usage based on past data. We cast this problem as a time series prediction problem. We collect machine usage data from a university campus fitness center for four machines, cardio, free weights, strength machines and Synergy 360, for three time periods during the day, morning, afternoon, and evening. To address this problem we use an encoder-decoder based sequence-to-sequence -sequence deep learning model, which consists of two components, an encoder and a decoder, each of which is an RNN. At the highest level, the encoder accepts an input sequence X1 to Xn, which corresponds to the equipment usage in the last n time steps and generates a hidden encoded vector C which encapsulates information for the input sequence. This encoded vector is given as an input to the decoder which generates Yn plus 1 to Yn plus K, the predicted equipment usage for the next K time steps. The model consists of one stacked layer and 10 hidden units. Each cell in the RNN is a long short-term memory unit. We split the data into two parts, 75% for training, and 25% for testing. We extract samples using sliding window approach. We use data for the past two weeks to predict one week into the future. We compare the performance of the deep learning model with two baselines, linear regression, and RIMA. The results show the performance of the models with respect to RMSE and MAE for free like this morning session. We observe that the LSTM-based model significantly outperforms the baselines. We also observe that as time steps increase, the RMSE and MAE values also increase. This shows that LSTM-based model is able to make better predictions in the future as compared to linear regression or EMA. More details about the paper are available on the link on the screen. You can find more such cool videos on our channel. Thank you for watching and if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel.